All right, so I am recording my voice on this microphone and I'm recording with this GoPro. But yeah, today we're gonna be learning about, WebK about WebK WK WebView. And uh, yeah, I'm stoked. It's gonna be really quick. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so what I'm gonna do is, this is a new project. Go ahead and uh, create a new project. I haven't written any code. And let's quickly get a web view on the screen so we can display an in-app browser, okay? <clears throat> Whew. All right, so let's say let uh, w web view is equal to UI, no, 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 WK web view. And you'll see we don't have any uh, imports or any constructors. So let's just go ahead and import WebKit real quick. And then now you'll see that turns your color and we can choose a frame here. All right, and then in another video, like one I'll record right after this, I'll show you how to do this uh, with auto layout constraints. And then another on stack views with this. But for right now, we're just gonna do the very basics. It's gonna take about five lines or something. So yeah, let's say view.frame. And then let's just say view.addSubView. Let's say web view. And then let's say we need to create a URL. And if you scroll down here in the documentation, you'll see it's really easy and you could have just read this, but uh, I thought I might as well produce a little video for you guys just to kind of learn it quicker and have it explained a bit better. So let's say, just like this, let's say let URL is equal to URL. And then let's say string. And then in that string, let's just say www. No, let's say HTTPS colon slash slash www.instagram.com slash maxcodes.io. One of my Instagram profiles, the other is maxcodes. And uh, let's create a request. So let's say let request is equal to URL request. And one thing I want you to notice here is that in theirs, they are putting the exclamation point here. We're gonna put it on our URL. And if that doesn't make any sense, just follow along, you'll understand in a second. I'm gonna say URL, they put theirs right here. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna put it up here like we've done, okay? That basically is just saying, hey, we know this is gonna be a, a deal, like a, a valid URL and it's not gonna crash. So we're using this bang to say, yo, that's what's up. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna say webview.load and then we're just gonna put the request in there. And then let's reload our application, recompile it. And uh, we should be in business. Uh, <laughs> Let's just see if it's working. All right, so you can see here uh, in the video and on the screen, I don't know why I'm moving the camera, but basically you can see that it's working and we have pulled up this profile. So if you want more content like this and you want to see how like I come up with this content and how my, what my general process is, just give me a follow on Instagram here at maxcodes.io and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video.